Hey guys, so it is the 12th of April, around 5 p.m. right now. Um, it is the first day since lockdown is easing off in about four months. So first day that the gyms are going to be opening. So it's going to be really exciting to go back to the gym today, see all the family, see everyone. Um, and the gym that I go to is the Brixton Street Gym, as it says on my top, okay, which is not your average commercial gym. It is more than a gym, it's a community. Um, make sure you guys check it out on Instagram it's Brixton Street Gym um, so I'm gonna show you guys sort of what my day is or what my evening is gonna be looking like because it's 5pm at the moment so I'm on my way there now okay um, there is a circuit class on tonight with Phil at 8pm um, which is the busiest class of all of them so I've literally just arrived to the Brixton Street Gym as you can see just here in the background sun's shining you can already hear the music pumping out loud. Yeah, I went I went down Central Oxford Street this morning and it was fully packed, full on. It's crazy, the busiest I've ever seen Oxford, Oxford Circus. But yeah, we're gonna go inside, have a look at a street gym. Fred, General, yeah. yeah. Brick the street gym all day. Every, every day. So I'm here with Terrell Lewis, founder of the Brixton Street Gym. Could you just tell me a little bit about the street gym, what you guys do for the community and everything else? Um, Brixton Street Gym, we've been here for a while now, going against the current, you know, ups and downs and hurdles, and you know, other authoritative figures. But yeah, we, we push against the current, we make good relationships, which has helped us to gain a facility, create jobs for people, help a lot of young people come up the streets, so for a lot of people change their lives around from a lot of negative situations. Or just even the mindsets of how they handle negative situations and experiences. So this this, this is more than a gym. It's a it's a hospital. It's yeah. a place of you know the mind, the body and the spirit. Yeah. And a place we can all come together. We are we're all jigsaw pieces individually, yeah. we come together to make that jigsaw puzzle. Yeah. We're a family, right? Family. Yeah, Brixton Street Gym. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, yeah. oh, it's Lena's here. Come here. I couldn't find your YouTube channel. You can't find oh. it. Well, you're gonna find it now. Matthew Ruiz. Type it in on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> so I've been doing strength and mobility work on my shoulder for the past two and a half months without any upper body training, as my shoulder has been hurting since November. So I've been doing a lot of stretching and a lot of mobility, um, which my stretching is pretty terrible. As you can see from the videos, um, a lot of resistance band work, a lot of stretching, foam rolling as well, which helps. So my shoulder has been hurting since November, so it's been at least six months now and two and a half months of no training. Um, hopefully in the next couple of weeks, I'll be back to training. So I've been doing this every single day. If you haven't seen my full video on shoulder mobility and strength work, make sure you check it out on my channel. Come Phil, I need to record you. For what? For YouTube, tell them what you're doing. <laughs> tell them what's going on tonight. Oh, hey. Yeah. We've got a BSG circuit. Yeah. Which stands for Brixton Street Gym Circuit. Yeah. 
which is every Monday and Wednesday at yeah. 8 p.m. We're just setting up now, yeah? Yeah, as you can see, setting up, looking around. Busiest class of them all, innit? Come on. Yeah, with the yeah, prints. Nah. 40 people. 40 people, yeah, shit. Yeah. And that's, that's on a bad day, innit? That's on a bad day. <laughs> But yeah. I'll tell everyone. Yeah, yeah, cool. Because we're changing the game. Yeah, we're going to see how it looks like tonight then, yeah? Cooking in here, it smells nice. Oh, tell mm. me what's cooking. What's cooking? Oh, so I added some self raising flour, mm -hmm. egg, milk, cinnamon, and poppy seeds. Nice, it looks good, it looks yum. I want one. Oh, you missed something else. You missed something else. What, what was the last one of these? Soya milk, uh, dates. Dates, dates okay. Yeah. That's good. In here, yeah? Yeah. yeah. So I'll speak now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah on board the uh, Brixton Street Gym, Bookstop Brixton is the hashtag here. And basically, this project is um, I get books donated um, from various members of the community. And they go out on shelves on Summer Lane Road and in Brixton Village and Market Road. So currently, as it stands, there's about 60 books a day go um, 30 from Summer Lane and 30 in the village and Market Road. Um, which is about 400 a week. So um, I'm busy with this project, uh, it's, it's constant. And um, yeah, if you wanted a book, uh, you can go onto Facebook, which is uh, Bookstop Brixton, message me and I'll probably call it. Um, I've also got Twitter, at Boyd Hill 6, and I, I update that with what's coming in. So every day new books come, and then people can come here and get it. Um, in terms of the space here, it's kind of closed because of the COVID, so most of the books are out here uh, in the hallway, and people who come to the gym can help themselves to free books. Yeah. Thank you for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So that is the end of today's vlog. Okay, down at the Brixton Street Gym. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram, Embrace Fitness, and also check out the Street Gym um, on Instagram. It's Brixton Street Gym. Make sure you guys come down.